So from the wind to the snow now, drivers heading through the gorge today ran into some wintry conditions. Some hit a little rain there as well, even some more of that wind we've been telling you about. As for one semi driver learned, those conditions can be very uh, unforgiving. KGW's Pat Doris reports. The semi jackknifed around noon today as it hauled food for Albertsons towards Portland. The crash shut down both lanes going west toward town and one lane going east. It took a couple of hours to clear the mess and the backup stretched for miles. The crash happened on a day that challenging winter driving arrived in the gorge. High winds made me wonder if this trailer would make it to its destination. I think it did. And lots of water on the roadway meant a near constant spray on the windshield. As the delay around the crash grew, truck drivers started pulling off at the edge of Hood River to think about their options. I figured it was a good time to talk about driving in the gorge. Mike Houlihan normally hauls freight up Interstate 5. This is just his third trip through the gorge. It's very stressful on me in the dark. And once the sun comes up, I'm a little better off because I'm pretty unfamiliar with it. Omero Garcia has driven the gorge for five years. He said no matter the weather, there's usually one common issue. The main factor for accidents, the main thing is just speed. You know, if you go slow, you're more likely will be okay. Of all the drivers I've met, John Bozalski seemed to enjoy driving truck in the gorge the most. I love the gorge. I live in Vancouver, Washington, and my wife and I make the gorge our happy place. But he knows the weather can make conditions challenging. This morning, he felt the power of the wind as he rounded Crown Point heading toward Portland. When I hit that point, I'll tell you, it was like being pushed by a jet engine. Yeah, it was really amazing. Our, these trucks are like sailboats, you know, they're just great big sails. It was raining and hailing at the time of the jackknife truck crash today. The driver was cited for going too fast for conditions. And Oregon State Police say other drivers on the scene complained that the truck was obviously going too fast before it crashed. Out here when conditions get bad, there is very little room for error. Near Hood River, Pat Doris, KG.